We have a health alert tonight. The FDA is stepping in after receiving dozens of reports of problems from people who underwent LASIK surgery to correct their vision. Dr. Malika Marshall takes a closer look at some of the complaints and what the government plans to do about them. The government wants to take another look at LASIK surgery. The reason? Patients like these. All three say the procedure actually damaged their vision. Now everything is slightly doubled to the right. I see three moons at night. I mean, if I look out there in, in my worst eye, I mean, it's totally hazed over. I certainly regret having it. I think it was the worst thing that ever happened to me. LASIK uses a laser to reshape the cornea and has given millions of patients 20-20 vision. I don't have to worry about having uncomfortable contacts in my eyes all the time. But in the past few years, the FDA has received 140 reports of problems. On Friday, the agency is holding a public meeting to hear complaints. Nine years of hell is a better way to describe it. The Society of Eye Surgeons who perform LASIK say they have a 95 percent satisfaction rate. The group is expected to tell the FDA that most side effects are rare and temporary. Dr. Robert Seichert from the Langone Medical Center says not everyone is a candidate for LASIK, especially if a patient's pupil is too large or the cornea is too thin. So I turn away approximately 20 percent of patients who are interested in having LASIK. But Michael Patterson says he was considered a good candidate by his doctor. The, the only way to protect yourself from LASIK is to not have it. Friday's FDA hearing is part of a study on the safety and satisfaction of LASIK. It's not yet known when results will be available. Dr. Malika Marshall, CBS News.